After this video, you already know exactly how to stop scrolling. By stop scrolling, that means just stop spending a lot of time on social media in general. Especially Instagram and TikTok, those platforms that you spend a lot of time. This video is for only the one who are really serious about quitting these vices. If you don't really want to quit them, if you don't feel peace that you are wasting your life on them, then just click off this video right now, bro. This video is just a waste of time for you. The first step is to reframe this habit in your mind. Stop feeling of scrolling and like spending time in social media is something that is acceptable. This is not acceptable. This is so great for you. You should feel disgust, shame, and guilt that you are doing this activity. You are wasting your potential like 99% of losers in modern era. You are doing the same hobby that fucking losers like the bottom 10% of men are doing. You are scrolling and see half naked women on TikTok. On Instagram, and you feel less, and you want to fuck, and you want to do all this shameful things, and you're wasting so much of your time. Even if you don't do it, this is a broadcast for your social media. You should still feel shame and guilt when you do it, because you know that this is bad for you. And you are still taking part in the activity of scrolling. You are self sabotaging yourself, and you should feel this. Cut. And the first step is to refrain it in your mind and feel disgust and shame. Because if you want to feel this disgust and shame, you won't really want to change. And that's what will spark your motivation to change. The second step is to delete it. The reason why is because I want you to imagine this guy that just lives his day to day life, he's eating food and everything, he's working out and everything, he forgets that Instagram, that this platform exists because he doesn't see in his day-to-day -day life. It's the 1900 and he's just living his day-to-day -day life like a normal human being. Instagram was not invented at this time. There was not phones and everything, no social media in general. And he doesn't think about it because they have no cues if she's in environment for this thing. And they have no triggers to this activity in his environment. Well, not in the 1900. And the closest thing that you can do to relate to this guy that hasn't spent time on social because it doesn't know what it is, is to just delete it from your phone. That's the simplest thing you can do. And another thing that deleting social media will do for you is that it will increase the friction of going and scrolling. Even if you will go and download it back, you will have so much more friction to do so to download it and then log in to your account back, then scroll. Let feel shame and guilt as you download it back. Your thoughts will try to convince you to do it, but the other part of your brain will tell you to not do it. And that's what you want to do. And you have now FOMO. Fear of missing out. You won't be able to spend time with your friends on Instagram. They are not your friends, by the way. Because you are only spending time together on Instagram and platforms. They are not your friends. They are not your real friends. And the content you are consuming, you have a fear that you won't consume it anymore. That you won't know what is the up with this influencer that you really like anymore. I promise to you that after the leaking it, like two or three days, you will forget that this person exists and you will feel glad that you deleted it. The third step is to never go back. The habit of scrolling and spending time on social media, even after you will quit, you will still have this habit built in your psyche. And if you will go back, you will build this habit a lot faster, like with the good habit, like when you go to the gym and you build like a great body after one or two or three years. If you will quit the gym and then you will go back, you will build the muscle a lot faster. It is the same with habits, especially bad ones, like scrolling on social media and everything so we don't want to go back so what you need to do is to resist the urges to re-download the apps to spend time on social media again you will have to resist them with willpower and after enough time these urges will disappear and you will be completely free from these platforms you would have so much more time in your day-to-day -day life that's great. You are fucking happy and glad that you deleted them and resist them. And you realize that your attention span has just increased by like two or three points. You feel great.